French President Emmanuel Macron has welcomed King Charles back to France ahead of his official state visit today, telling him, you visited as a prince, you return as a king. The king and queen who were seen getting on their plane this morning are said to arrive in Paris this afternoon amid a major security operation six months after they were forced to postpone their trip because of violent protests in the country. Taking to social media to welcome the monarch, President Macron shared a video montage of archive footage of the king's previous 34 trips to the country as the Prince of Wales. Pregnant videos span over a decade, some showing a very young Charles, while others show him speaking in French. At one point, admitting, I don't practice a French language enough. Charles, 76 years old, and Camilla, 74 years old, will divide their time between Paris and Bordeaux, packing in 21 high-profile engagement just three days. Sharing footage of the king being welcomed onto his jet this morning, Charles and Camilla said in a joint tweet, We are so looking forward to joining you in Paris and Bordeaux. As we embark on our first state visit as king and queen to France, a country for which we both have the greatest love and admiration, a special bond between our two countries and all that your wonderful country has to offer. Charles and Camilla will meet President Macro, 45 years old, and his wife, Brigitte, 70 years old, for a ceremony of remembrance and refraining at the Arc de Triomphe in the capital's center later today. The king will be invited by the president to, to symbolically the monument's eternal frame which burns in memory of those who died in the First and Second World War. As part of the president, Macro will host a state banquet in the Hall of Mi Mirrors at Azel, while the king will become the first British royal to address the French Senate, speaking in both English and French. The king was forced to cancel his state visit to France after widespread rioting began across the country, opposing Macron's retirement age reforms. It was said to be the king and queen's first state visit following the death of Queen Elizabeth. But Germany, the second leg of the journey, became the historic first destination to the couple. In the day is leading up to the planned visit. Protesters death to the king in the, tr in the threatening red paint across buildings warning the violence would worsen if the monarch arrived. The, pretty, the British government was asked by the French leader to postpone the trip at the time after French unions called the nationwide pension protest to coincide with the king's visit.